Hello guys, what is up? It is me Rahul here bringing you guys an episode of the Madden 22 Face with Franchise. And today, we are going up against the Buffalo Bills in the one and only AFC Divisional Round. Now, you might be thinking to yourself, Raul, why are you in the divisional round? Well, because we went undefeated and we made it. We made it to the playoffs. And, rest assured, um, we got the first round by. So, oh. Uh, we are going up against the Buffalo Bills today. Excuse me. And. Yep. I am very surprised that. This series is going underway. And we have 70 touchdowns. And at least 20 picks. At least. So. They're at our home field. We have to pass for at least 304 yards. So it could be 304 or more. If you guys do enjoy this video, please be sure to drop a like. Don't forget to subscribe and click on that notification bell. So you don't miss a video. Also, you see there, Kansas City. So the winner of this game has to face Kansas City in the next in the AFC championship game. But that does mean we get if we win, we get home field advantage. If Buffalo wins, I assume that Kansas City gets home field advantage. So either way you know so, on the other side, the Dallas Cow- on the other- in the NFC, the Dallas Cowboys have won. And let me tell you, they're the number one seed. They are the number one seed, while the Seahawks are the number five seed. We're the one, number one seed. I think Kansas City is the number two seed. And- I do not know how that was throw out of a sack. Ten and seven versus eleven and six versus eleven and six. That's what's going on. And Matthew Stafford had a terrible game. <laughs> Twenty eight to ten. And if the Cowboys make it to the Super Bowl, out of all wonders. We will be going to the Super Bowl against the Dallas Cowboys. Now, mind you, if you remember in my Chicago Bears franchise, um, actually not yet. <laughs> we haven't faced the Dallas Cowboys yet, but, well, we have, but we lost. So, the first season. And then, yeah. So, AFC Championship has been set, at least for Buffalo or Jacksonville. I don't want Buffalo to go back. I want a new person in town, Jacksonville. And, to be quite honest, um... Personally, after seeing the uh, the divisional round again, the divisional game against Kansas City and um, Buffalo, Buffalo needs to like have, have a seat, and you know, uh, let um, Kansas City do their thing. As you see, we give it to David Robbins. Uh, James Robinson, not David Robinson. 
<laughs> and we go with the gold line play action. I'm running in. Now, I do have Bazooka on. I am willing to get Omaha if I ever switch to a new archetype. So, this does mean if I unlock every single ability, every single one, that will be massive. Um, Madden 23, the trailer has been released. Um, I do plan on leaving a link in that link in the description down below so you guys can check that out. Um, I will make sure I do that. I will basically say that Manage 23 has to be very good. Um, that's all I could basically say. They're saying stuff about franchise now. All I ever want is franchise to be good. And for a movement for franchise to be good. And for anybody not educated, this all started back in Madden, for Madden 21. It kind of slowed down for Madden 22. Now it has to work for Madden 23. And we got a touchdown with Carter Landry. So, let me just preface this by saying, if and only if, I'll say this, I will not do a face of the franchise for Madden um, 23 because they completely switched it. Now, you are in your fifth season and you have to prove yourself in that season rather than going through a season like this your rookie year and everything um that is kind of messed up because it kind of ruins the purposes of a career mode now i might do i might play it all by own just to give it a test but I don't see myself doing a proper series audit if I ever buy Bat 23. Now, the other thing is, is that if I am able to have a, um, I'm gonna state this. If I ever, uh, well, here you go, here's the touchdown. If I ever, okay, if I ever, ever will play another video game other than NFL, NHL, NBA 2K, um, I might do baseball or I might do the UFC, which sounds very bizarre to say the least, but... You know, I want to give it a shot because I've been liking the UFC so far of what they're doing. And there's no boxing video game, at least for the Xbox One. So, I want to see what I can do with a UFC video game. This is what I stated in the last video. If you want, to, if you want me to see do retro video games or... New video games are going to be coming out, especially since I want to do some videos when I'm in college or any other ventures I want to do. Please be sure to drop a like and do not forget to subscribe because I do want you guys to stick around with me in this YouTube journey and you guys mean a lot to me, so yeah. As you see, back to the video, um, we're in, <laughs> they, uh, I played this game, my friends, but, a hey, um, this is cringe, <laughs> like, this, Madden, like, I always talked about it, including Madden 25, Madden Mechanics, 
are not that good at all. And I will say that the worst of which is where I had to heave down a ball third down and twenty third down and long to Marvin Jones Jr. and um the worst of which for the game mechanics is that um Sax O line is pretty terrible. Also, I have to mention for Madden twenty three, there's an anonymous coach who decided to get rid of make the playbooks a lot shorter, a lot smaller, because some of the concepts that we that I have used in any any player in Madden, what regardless of piece of franchise or franchise or exhibition or ultimate team, the playbooks that we're using have so many concepts to the point where the coaches that this anonymous coach was like, we don't use some of these concepts, so we're going to shrink it down to what the actual NFL team uses, which I think is a pretty good idea, to be honest, because I don't recognize what I look at a football a football game like this, I do not recognize some of the concepts in in game like football video a football game versus this game Madden. I do not see the same concepts unless they're added and another touchdown like like the playmaker ability in Madden. Yeah, that is somewhat replicated in um in real life when a player has to come quarterback or go farther down the field in order to get the ball. That's realistic, but playbooks oh it's eh, not realistic because it it just isn't in my opinion. So like that's why I think that's a good decision. So, bear in mind, if I do not have Madden 23, it might be because of franchise. Now, I've always talked about NCAA 14 coming to the channel, or at least a revamped version. Um, I have to find a way to actually play... The Xbox controller on the PC. So that way I can actually play NCAA 14. Now I could do keyboard. But I'm not a PC guy. And I usually play Minecraft. Which I haven't done in a while. If you want to see Minecraft on the channel. Let me know. But. <laughs> hey. Um. Yeah, that this play, I'm going to say, I don't think it's the type of play I would ever use. I don't recommend this to anyone who's starting up at it. Do not use that play in the Jacksonville Jaguars playbook. Don't ever use that, ever. Because, yeah, as you see right here, easy dot to Carter Landry. <laughs> touchdown we're blowing out the buffalo bills on our home turf <sighs> and hey i think i'm gonna stay at jacksonville for a very long time and this is not saying like i could go to another team and <laughs> Personal foul, unnecessary roughness, defense. Who is it? Jerry Hughes. And we're on the 30-yard line. Chanel Jr. I mean, we have a pretty good squad. Like, a really good squad. And I cannot say more. Um... This team 
is pretty much one of those teams where I'm that lead for it. Carter Landry is up next. And I don't even know why I like fumbled, but good hit stick right there. As I, I did not expect, like, this player to have a really good hit stick, like, power, so, um, now I'm running the ball, and I'm, like, breaking tackles, and literally everything in between, so, rest assured, you have a player, me, in game, in as a Jacksonville Jaguar, being like, what the heck? So <laughs> there you go. And I gotta say, this is a really good team. I just have to say, like, thanks so much for the series. Um. I keep on saying things, but, like, I really mean it every single time because, yeah, <laughs> this is possibly one of the craziest series ever since Madden 20 piece of the franchise. And, like I said, I will possibly do a quarterback franchise again, but this time with the Washington Commanders. Or the Detroit Lions. I will possibly do a franchise. Not fully customized. And like broke it like by Chicago Bears. But. Yeah and. It's not going to be a relocation franchise either. Um. But there is a possibility of me doing a golden ticket. Or a back your ballers, whatever the case may be. But hey, <laughs> it's all up in the air, and you know, I'm just like, like 45 to 17. We already put this game away. Cardinal Landry has his X back activated, and we're just marching down the field. Um. He's like my main go-to guy, including Chanel Jr. Flow to her set when he's in the game. Um, James Robinson, Travis Annette Day, those players, and um, yeah, and I do uh, think that we're gonna win the Super Bowl. Pretty much because of our squad and how a rookie quarterback is literally leading the squad. And I haven't had an interception yet. So, I'm kind of having a perfect game. But, at the end of the day, it is what it is. And hey, I threw a touchdown once again. And so, yeah. Um... Thank you guys so much for watching. Y'all are legends of my book as well as for me. See you on the next one. Peace.